Good morning, sheep fans. Cammy's the name. Sheep's the game. As Lizzie says, what we at today? Well, we've already been and got sheep in this morning. We were kind of just pushing on, getting things done. I got the last of my wool away as well. Well, almost. There's still some bags lying at another shed I need to deal with. It never ends. Here's the sheep. A, a real mixed bag here. Some old ewes. You see, we've had fly struck ones and. There's some lame ones here as well, somewhere. It's a never outside fern, outside. It's a never ending job with these girls here. We're going to sort these all out. These are getting weaned today. These are Cheviot Mule ewe lambs here. There's one of my sore foot, bit of a limp. We showed all these, that was in a previous video. So the mules, weathers, there's one got a bit of, oh, she's had fly strike as well. Just so many trees. The, the flies are unbelievable up here. They have all been treated. Um, but it's unbelievable how many were rubbing their head. I don't know if anyone saw. We did a Facebook video doing a bit of crow vecting and we we're really making a, an effort just to cover the head with some crow vect. Just to, uh, they've all had click, but it was just this head issue. They were all rubbing their head on the fences and the flies making them bust their ears. And we thought we'll put a wee dab of crow vect over their heads and it seems to have helped actually. Um, so yeah. Right, we'll run these through and start shedding. I should tell you before we start shedding just exactly what's in here. So this is Blackies and Cheviots with Cheviot mules and Scotch mule ewe lambs and weather lambs of course and there is the odd mule that, like Gimmer, like adult mule ewe that isn't meant to be here uh, but she is so, okay, let's get them shed oh. Bad start, I'm not selling yet Now, now I've shown them, it's hard, hard to pick out what ones are lambs and what ones aren't. Because I've shown them, it's such a, it, it's such a mess on the brain. I'll try to pick them out. Lambs, are, lambs and ears are looking quite good actually. Okay, excuse the sunglasses, it's quite bright today. So we've got them shed out. Next job is to get the trailer in position. We're going to run the lambs back through, shed them again. The female lambs, which are ewe lambs, that some of them, not all of them, but most of them, we will keep as replacement stock. And the boys will go to some grass and eventually they'll go to the market. Let's get in position. The girls say stop, you've came far enough, that looks okay, yep, gate from there and a gate from there. There we go. There we go. How's it supposed to go? The other way, the round bits, hook in there. So it's just, a, just right enough, just the other way around. You might have washed the bits too. And the dishwasher ran out. Oh, that's right, it did, it did, aye. That's right, apologies.
my god, that was sir. Take it right up first and then come back. Off she goes with the, the CF Moto. Got that one second hand from John Murray at Dundonald. If anyone's looking, I think he's always got a wee, a wee stock of them, or certainly he'll know where to get you one. Here we go. They're spinning in circles. First time they've ever been as a group themselves, so they're being as awkward as they possibly can be, going round and round in circles. As he'll push them a bit with a quad bike, that'll always help. Here we go, they're actually looking quite good. I must say, since they've been shown, they're fair, come on, to a game, lie down, Fern. Here we go, in the pen. Easy, lie down, Meg. Easy. This one. It's been jagged already, I see. Yep, yep. Okay, mums are shouting for their babies. The ewe lambs are loaded. Weathers were put back out to the field. Meg's watching on intently. I'm trying to undo a bit of rope with my left hand. And we've got there. Oh. String, string, string. What would we do without it? We're loaded, let's get them to grass. Sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty, thirty-one, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-three in the bottom. I think there is thirty-five on the top. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, twenty-nine, thirty, thirty-one. Shows what I know. That was just a guess anyway. Sixty-four, sixty-four ewe lambs there, put onto grass, and we have so sixty-four ewe lambs onto grass there, homebred. We have eighty-one, I think, or around about eighty to pick up tomorrow from our good friend Billy Welsh, we're buying his ewe lambs, this will be the third year in a row we've bought his ewe lambs. So of course, we'll show you that. It's a little bit longer than it should be, this grass been rested a bit too long. But these little ewe lambs will get into it and then we'll put another 80 or so with them tomorrow. From Billy. 142 ewe lambs for next year. I mean, I don't know, my plans change all the time, but I think 142, I think that's us, done buying ewe lambs. I want to stop buying in. I, I tell you what I really want to do. I know I'm contradicting myself because this year we're going to be buying in about 300 ewes to go to Lizzie's new farm, our new land. But even that, we have an exciting thing planned with that. We were going to try three different rams. I know I spoke about it in a previous video. What are we going to do? We are going to put a Logie, which is a type of ram by Logie Durno, versus a Frontera, which is another Logie Durno ram, versus an Aberfield SR, and I might even buy a Highlander as well. We're going to Kaleo next week. There's a video to come from the end of this sale. We'll do a video of that. And we're going to see what, what sheep is better. And the plan is we'll give them 80, 70, 80 ewes each, and probably 70, if we get four, but 75 each. See if they can tap all them, and see what ewe lambs we like better, and then the idea is keep a close flock of one of them. Just, let's try it. Make a good video if nothing else. That's us for this one, sheep fans. It just I look at our new lambs there and yeah, keeping you up to date with things more and more. I try to get more videos out, more regular, not overdo it. Hope you enjoyed it. See you for the next one. Please do check out the merch store. It absolutely pays the bills here. I say it all the time, but 
it is what keeps this whole thing on the road. See you for the next one.